Speaking of cars, someone on this panel is one of the millions out there who have dealt with motion sickness. <laughs> one in particular has it pretty, pretty badly. In fact, yeah. Rosie has it so badly. It yeah. has been something you've dealt with this for many years. Check this one out. I love being a part of the doctor's family. In my career, it really consists of a lot of travel. I live in Vegas, and I have to drive back and forth between Vegas and LA, but I have been getting motion sickness. The strange thing is that when I'm driving, no problem. But when I'm in the passenger side, <laughs> it's constantly drive, 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 pull over, and then I throw up. Oh my God. So I can't focus on anything. She is a very loud person. I know when she's getting sick, when she's silent. California roads are bumpy. The traffic here is horrible. Fast, 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 slow, slow, slow. Oh, that was a pothole. I don't love California roads. The saliva starts building up. That taste, that taste, that horrible taste. Once that starts kicking in, it's not good. I'm like, hey. <laughs> pull over, pull over, pull over. Pull the car over now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, babe, this sucks. Yeah. I really don't want to throw up again. I've been dealing with this for the last couple years. I just feel nauseous, babe. I just feel nauseous. I don't want to be stopping in the middle of the freeway and throwing up. I don't understand why I get sick. You know there's there's car sickness, but that's yeah. that's extreme. Yeah, um, it's it's interesting that that and I know when I go on planes and there's turbulence, I get really sick, and it's embarrassing that you have to throw up in front of everybody. I felt so bad because yesterday I I threw up three times and. I, my husband pulled in front of someone's driveway. I feel so bad because there was nowhere to pull over. And I just feel bad because since I got married, you know, he traveled, we travel together, we go to different places, and he's always driving. And I didn't notice the car sickness until I got married. And he's like uh, driving along and just really getting sick. And just once that saliva starts coming up, once I feel that burning sensation, it's done. And it feels horrible because it's time that I could spend with bonding with him and just enjoying the ride over to LA. And we're gonna talk more with Rosie about this because there's actually a handheld product that says it can help rewire your brain to help fight motion sickness. Rosie actually put this to the test, so we're gonna see her using it, hear if it worked. That'll be later in the show. And thank you for sharing that with us, because a lot of people out there do suffer with it.